making a cell. Well, that's all for today. Yay! Don't forget that you have a project to do for next week. Oh, no. About ten exceptional insects who made a mark on meadow history. I completely forgot. Yeah, me too. So which insects are we going to write about? I know who can give us some help. Come on, Willy. Mm -hmm. Then there's Otto the Cockroach, who discovered that bluebird droppings would get rid of bee lice. And also Josephine the Dragonfly, who hypnotized toads by spinning in the air. This is amazing, Flip. You are the living memory of the meadow. With Josephine, mm -hmm. that makes nine. We just need one more. Let me think about it. Another exceptional insect. Not easy. Make way! Make way for my dung ball! Hello, Kurt. Hey, do you know a famous dung beetle who left their mark on insect mm -hmm. history as part of our project mm -hmm. for school? A famous dung beetle? Uh, well, yes, there's lots of them. Let's see, uh, mm -hmm. there's, uh, well, uh, 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 come back to me. Uh, I, I don't know. Mm -hmm. You mean there are no famous dung beetles? Well, no. It's okay. I just thought of a tenth insect who left their mark on history. Bob the Woodlouse. He climbed the Hill of Fear in less than a day. That's great, Flip. My pleasure. Well, with that last insect, our list is complete, and our project will be perfect. It's unbelievable. Just unbelievable! Hello, Kurt. How are you? How am I? Do you realize that there are famous wood lice, but not dung beetles? Ah. Uh. Yes. But things are going to change around here, I'm telling you. I'm going to restore the honor of the dung beetles. Forward march! Ah! I didn't understand a thing, but it didn't seem very interesting. Yes! Yes, come on, come on! Catch it, Maya! Got it! <laughs> I win! Make way! Make way for my ball! No, 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 no! <gasps> oh. Mm, wow. Hey, Kurt, your dung ball's enormous today. You ain't seen nothing yet. I'm gonna make the biggest dung ball ever. I, Kurt, will be the first dung beetle in history of famous insects. Yeah, I'll show them. That's right. I'll show them. Hmm? Make way! Make way for my ball! Watch out! <laughs> <laughs> Hey, are you out of your mind? <laughs> Troops, today we're training to keep our self-control in any circumstance. Rule number one, never lose sight of... Oh, oh. Hey, come on! Yeah. What did he say? Huh? Ah! <laughs> hmm? What's, what's going on? Huh? Oh, oh. Oh. This is unbelievable. I've had enough. We can't oh, allow that. That is disgusting. I can't take it anymore. Please, everyone. The spring meeting of the Meadow Insects is now open. I summon this special SMMI because we have a major problem. Kurt and his ball. What about it? What's wrong with my ball? Well, it's an enormous stinky ball. Because of it, the air in the meadow has become unbearable. Absolutely! If this goes on, we're finding a new meadow with fresh air. You can smell it even in my tunnels. Well, you'll just have to live with it. It truly is beautiful, Uncle. Please, Kurt, be reasonable. This cannot go on. You have to destroy that ball. What? Never! Ah, I see you're all jealous, huh? You'd like to all have a big dung ball and become famous, too. But the legend here is me, Kurt. With my big ball, I'll go down to history! Ciao! Oh dear. I get the feeling the problem is not totally solved. Oh man. I'm sorry, everyone. If I hadn't asked him that question about famous insects, we wouldn't be here. Hmm. You know what? Ben and I will try to speak to him in private, since he trusts us. Maybe he'll be a bit more understanding. Hmm. Mm -hmm. <laughs> what? With this, my ball, no one will come and bother you. Uncle, huh. what are you doing? I built a totally thorny and insurmountable fence. Hmm? It's to protect my dung ball while I rest. 
Uh, don't you think this thing about exceptional insects has gone a little bit to your head? You're, how can I say this? Completely crazy? Yes. I can see what you're both up to. You want to steal my ball and become famous, don't you? But, Uncle... Don't come any closer, Ben. Same for you, Maya. No entry allowed. This is private property. Hmm? My uncle just about threw us out. Yes, we really need to come up with a solution. We need to find someone that he'll talk to, but besides his big ball, I don't know who. Hmm. Yes, that's huh? it. That's what? We've got to find Max. <laughs> hey, wait for me! Tell me again why I have to go. Because you're the only one who can go into the ball. Digging into dung. Yuck. What do you mean, yuck? Mm? Dung is the best. Right. Do you remember hmm. everything you have to say once you're inside there? Don't worry. I've got a good memory. I'm an earthworm, not a slug. <laughs> yuck. OK, here we go. <laughs> Speak? Yes. It's a miracle. Great, it's working. I knew it. I knew that one day one of my dung balls would talk to me. Thanks to you, a great destiny awaits me, Kirk. Really? Yes. I'm so beautiful and big now that I must reign over the valley of dung balls. What? Yes, take me there where I will live happily forever. I have to leave you there? Yes, Kurt. I know it's difficult, but that's my destiny. Thanks to you, I will be the king of the Valley of the Dung Balls, and your name will be famous forever. Uh. All right, my ball. I will be worthy of this important mission you have assigned me. Uh, uh, where exactly is it? At the rocky outcrop, behind the heap of stones. All right. Uh. Off we go. Here we go, my ball! Come on, Ben. We have to get there first. And here we are. Ah, I've rolled many balls in my life, but like you, never. The two of us really made a wonderful team. What's happened to Max? He's got to get out. If not, he'll fall over the cliff with the ball. I thought I would never leave you, that I'd be rolling with you until the end of my days. And yet, we must go our separate ways. Mm. Let's go. Mm. Max, what are you doing? I don't feel very well. It's this smell. I can't go on. Oh, help me. Oh, no. Max. Oh, you boy, will oh, boy. Over the Valley of the Dung Balls while I enjoy the celebrity I've gained thanks to you, beautiful. And even though others will come after you, you will remain forever and always my favorite ball. Farewell, my bally wally. No, stop! Hmm? My ball. It's strange your voice has changed. It, uh, the emotion. Uh, I do am very moved. I, I wanted to say that you, you completely forgot the traditional farewell dance. Farewell dance? Yes, it's very important. You have to do the entre chef, pirouette, badure, badure, forte, forte, and jazz hands. Uh, well, if it's important. Antosha. <laughs> Pirouette! Pas de way, pas de way! Max! Fuete, fuete! And jazz hands! There! All done! Ben, Max! I can push you towards your destiny! Mm -hmm. Wait! Yeah. 
want to be an extraordinary insect, I'd rather spend my life eating good food and napping. <laughs> Hi, everyone! Hi, Hi Ben! Ben. <laughs> Thanks again for everything you did for my uncle, especially you, Max. I'm always ready to lend a hand. Has Kurt stopped thinking about his big ball? No, and now he's happy because he got into the Guinness Book of Insects. His giant ball was just approved. Everything is back to normal then? <laughs> Hi, kids! I've got a new project that'll also go down in Meadow history. The first